Thank you, thank you, sir. Uh, Captain Kawauchi, a Japan Self-Defense Force sailors and airmen, and a Marines and sailors, a Marine Aircraft Group 12, Marine Fighter Attack Squadron 242, and the crew of USS America. First, sir, I want to extend Lieutenant General Clarity's and Major General's apologies for not being able to attend this historic event. So they both recognize this is a huge milestone for Japan, and all of us are eager for the opportunity to once again closely work with our Japanese allies to provide support as Japan moves forward, move one step closer towards operating their own F-35Bs. Second, I want to recognize that this U.S.-Japan alliance has served as a cornerstone for regional peace and security for over 60 years and remains indispensable to our mutual security interests in the Indo-Pacific. This alliance includes close cooperation between our forces, but also extends beyond that to include living as neighbors and sharing a community between our families. This weekend is a prime example. School-aged children from all around Japan will participate in an art camp with our students here at Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni. At the same time, our Marines and sailors will embark aboard Japanese ship Izumo to live side by side with their Japan Self-Defense Force counterparts as they prepare to conduct the first ever landing of two F-35B aircraft aboard a Japanese vessel. An incredible weekend for the U.S.-Japan alliance. Additionally, MAG-12's Aviation Logistics and Wing Support Squadrons were honored to host logistics ex experts from the J Japan Air and Maritime Self-Defense Forces this week for subject matter expert exchanges in support of F-35B operations. So we value the opportunity to learn from one another as you prepare to maintain and operate this aircraft in an expeditionary manner. However, this could not occur without the tireless efforts and support of Colonel Lewis, his Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni team, and the city of Iwakuni. For the Marines and sailors of Marine Fighter Attack Squadron 242 and the members of USS America crew, the eyes of the world are on you and your ability to integrate with our key ally. More importantly, critical members of the region will be watching closely as we will have to recognize, they will have to recognize the bilateral interoperability demonstrated by this event cannot be accomplished by any other member in the region. The dedicated cooperation and determination demonstrated by sailors and airmen of the J Japan Self-Defense Force, the sailors of the USS America, and the Marines of BMFA 242 is what makes this alliance unbreakable. I want you all to remain focused and ensure the successful execution of this critically important capabilities test that you should be very proud to be a part of. Good luck to all of you, Semper Fidelis, and serve may you have fair winds and following seas.